Hi guys, today we're going to be looking at this really cool Smash animation, um, which is very simple, you can learn it in like 3 minutes, like the one in the preview. Let's get right into it to learn how to do it. So you just want to open up a new presentation in PowerPoint, go to design and change the background to whatever you want. I think black looks the best um, because it's really dark and when the smash happens it's very contrasted. Now what you want to do is just also make the layout to blank in the home section just to have a blank slide to work with. We're just going to put a text box in and write text, okay? Um, now this I think will be best as an exit animation, so for the animation to be exited and I'm just going to first format the, the text and just make aerial black because that's what I like. Um, you just choose whatever you want and just center it, align center, uh, sorry, align, sorry, align center, align middle and there we go. Okay, so now we're ready to do the animation. Um, first of all, we just need to add a new slide very quickly, um, just changing the background to black. Very simple. Now for the second slide, just make sure it's the second slide, not the first slide. And this can be in the middle of your PowerPoint if you want. Um, and what you're going to do is just go to transition, go down and click on fracture, which is in the exciting animation in the second section down. So it's there. And you can see that actually just fractures the text because the way this works is that since the background of this is the exact same color as the, as the second slide, there will be no animation um, between those because it, it will be doing it to the whole slide just so that you won't be able to see because it's against a black background It's exactly the same color and you can do this not with just text You can also do it with the image, but text looks the best which is why this is a smash text animation So if you found this tutorial helpful make sure to leave a like and subscribe down below Also check out some of my other animation videos that you might find helpful for example my text reveal animation my spinning text animation stuff like that Anyway, thanks for watching and I'll see you next time